saying goodbye with the team where it all began. I get to retire as a Calgary Flame. What's next for Theron Fleury? Now from Global Calgary, the News Hour with Gord Gillies and Brian Hurlburt. Emotional but composed. Theron Fleury closed the door on a remarkable career today after an incredible comeback attempt. Well, one of the guys who covered most of that career was there, and Grant, uh, this really looked like a nice goodbye. I think this is the day Theron wanted to have six years ago when he first retired as a player. Absolutely. It was one of the nicest news conferences I've been to. Sad that he's leaving, yeah. but a celebration of the player. Theron Fleury's story ends the way it was supposed to. In just two weeks, the tarnished image of a player who was forced to leave the game because of a suspension for drug and alcohol abuse is gone. Fleury officially skates into retirement with newfound respect and dignity. Theron Fleury said so long once before, back in 98, after he was traded to Colorado. <laughs> 11 years later, a calmer, sober Fleury says goodbye again officially retiring as a player. As I left the Saddle Dome on Friday, I knew that this part of my life had finally come to an end. The emotions that I felt were the ones of someone who had left it all on the table. I did everything within my power to prolong the inevitable. So as I say goodbye today, I am at peace. I don't have anything left to prove to myself. The attention during his two-week comeback was enormous. To some, it falls short because he didn't make the team. I want you all to know that I could not sign with another team. I get to retire as a Calgary Flame. He may be leaving his hockey family, but his real family remains a big part of his life today. I'm blessed to have such an amazing, close family. You're proud of him right now, aren't you? Oh, I'm so proud of him. Yeah. <laughs> he did it. I've kind of been shocked ever since he called me and said that I'm done. It's just hard to believe that he didn't keep, like that it didn't escalate into a full season. Unlike Flurry of old, the Flurry of today, 41 years old, isn't just thinking of himself. He's thinking of others, like him, who may be struggling as he once did. Don't quit before the miracle. Thank you for your time today. Thank you. Grant Pollock, Global News. Now, Fleury says he's exploring a job opportunity with the Flames, but don't be surprised if the team retires his jersey number 14 this season. Right now, Gorlinda, he's getting ready to go on the road. He's going on a tour for his book, Playing With Fire. That's to be released next month. So we'll be chatting a lot about it, but I, I agree. That was just, even watching that, he looks so... A calm and serene and in control. 1998, you saw at the beginning of the clip, yeah, you know, he's yeah. all, all confused and crying. Yeah. Not in control. He was in control today. Here's a good thing. He is thinking of others because I wouldn't be surprised if there's a new drug addiction rehab center coming to Calgary for all of southern Alberta. Theron will be prominent with that, too. That's nice to hear. Well, he's earned that re reputation like you discussed and the he dignity sure, back. That's great sure to has. see. Thanks, Grant. You bet.